well good morning all on a Fenland rain in the sun. A beautiful way to start the day and a way to christen a new net of mine. The rubber nets are fantastic, the fish don't get tangled and I'm loving it. What a beautiful bite. I'm gonna give her a quick weigh, see what she weighs because I reckon she's about nine pounds, maybe more, but that might be pushing it. Only one way to find out. My scales went ten and a half pounds. I don't know how heavy the net is yet. What an absolutely beautiful fish. Absolutely stunning colours in the sun. Let's slip it back now. Well, I weighed the net and it weighed three quarters of a pound. So that's nine and three quarter pound fish in there. Nine pounds, 12 ounces. Absolutely stunning fish. Never been here before, crystal clear water, lovely little drain. An absolutely beautiful pike on the bank within 20 minutes of being here. Probably not even that. Let's slip it back. So many people have said to me, use fresh baits all the time, but that isn't true now, as I've just shown you. With the same piece of lamprey, what I caught the last fish on, and lost that jack on. There it is, hanging out its mouth, hooks came out in the net. What a beautiful fish. I reckon she's a double. Absolute cracking fish. This is the fourth day I've used this lamprey, so it just goes to show you can catch on an old bait. So don't throw your baits away every 15 minutes. Keep them out there, and especially with a nice bit of lamprey, when there's a lot of blood in there, it really does go a long way. It's gone down to 14, so 13 pounds, and four ounces, this fish. I reckon I'm going to catch another fish on that same bit of lamprey. For some reason they just love it here. I've never fished it before, but the smelting mackerel haven't had a sniff. Yet the lamprey, now I've moved, has had two fish out the same spot. What a stunning fish. Let's get it back. This rubber net, fox predator net, 30 inch net, only £17.50. And the fish won't tangle in it. They do do bigger nets, a lot bigger. But uh, that's big enough for a 20 easy. What a cracking fish. Yep. Let's uh, slide her back into the depth. Here we are. What a beauty. Off she goes. Back into the depths. Back to fight another day. Well, today's turned out to be a rather good day for me. It's about 11 o'clock now, I think. I have to check on time. Well in. Let's get to those other rods moved, recast, and possibly change the mackerel to a lamprey. Who knows, might just get me another. Well, it's nearly half two now, and I'm still in the same swim that I caught the last fish in. And I've not had any more bites. I started off in a swim next door, and I had one there fairly quickly and I moved up here an hour later and had those two within the next two hours. 
well, the one that got off, but nothing else yet. So what I'm thinking of doing now is, in the last remaining hour, now it's dry, is move up to the next swim, or maybe just a bit further. Maybe that'll give me another fish, who knows. But um, I don't think I'm going to get any more action here. So it's time to move. I've sat here for three hours now without a sniff, so I've got to do something. Yep, fish. Well, it's quarter past four and it's time to go home. All the stuff is packed away. It's been an absolutely fantastic day here. And I'm going out to another drain, hopefully within the next two days. So I shall see you then. Tight lines.